uh, cross machine learning algorithm and projecting uh, malicious node attack. So let's start with, with our presentation. Today, uh, I, I will start with a brief introduction about network security detection. Then I will talk about the problem with, uh, we try to solve. And then uh, we will give uh, the research question we investigate then the methodology that we proposed. And I will talk about the result, we got it. Then we will end up with our conclusion and the future work. So let's start with introduction of our network security. Uh, there are many devices connected to the internet, such as smartphones, smart cars, smart roads, etc. And these devices are generated with massive data and those data not all secured uh, because of there is uh, sometimes they got attacked. So we are using machine learning algorithm technology to identify and uh, classify. Uh, to identify and classify that's malicious or non malicious attack in the data for that there are different types of algorithm was proposed but since we are using different algorithm, we have different accuracy result. So our main uh, goal here to answer the question, which algorithm, uh, machine learning algorithm to trust? A machine learning algorithm does give uh, different accuracy. So we have to evaluate and uh, the accuracy of the result for each uh, of this AI algorithm. To do so, uh, we we will start with this simple example of, uh, about uh, Alex machine, uh, uh, smart machine. Alex will try to connect his uh, smart uh, coffee machine and access it using uh, his apps which installed in his mobile. Alex, he has connected his mobile to the internet and he put all the bank details in, in, the, in the apps. And there is a guy who called, sometimes we call it a hacker, scammer, sniffer, and those guys who try to access the information of the Alex. So our goals here to identify those uh, malicious attack uh, and we evaluate which, the, which are the best uh, machine learning algorithm. We try to uh, use them or to trust them. Uh, here, the main research question we try to solve it, who, how can a machine learning algorithm maintain the same level of the performance while protecting the network attack? We if it, if it take the, investigate, there are, there are uh, three sub question how can we identify the malicious node in the setting we where they have redundancy features and how accurate that are all the machine learning models to protect a malicious node if there is some noise uh, in the data and the third question we try to answer how machine learning models is uh, able to learn and predict the malicious node with unbalanced data. So our approach to uh, target these questions, we use uh, a Python scikit-learn to generate uh, synthetic data. We apply uh, rounded features and uh, noise and imbalanced data. Then we try to train our model to data train and testing data and we apply different machine learning classifier to get the result of uh, all those models and to evaluate them with different criteria. To do so, our methodology, we proposed the, the three different synthetic data sets which are created by using a scikit learn library and we evaluate them uh, using the 
uh, using the fifth floor clause validation. And then the second criteria we use the, uh, the evaluation matrix. We have used under area under procedure recall curve and to evaluate each machine learning algorithm. So the three uh, model, uh, sorry, the uh, six model, we use them, logistic regression and decision tree and support vector machine and gradient posting, then MTL, MLP, then the random forest classifier. So our setting for this simulation, we propose that the uh, for the first question, we put the setting that we have uh, a, a thousand nodes with 10 feature and we have imbalanced data, uh, sorry, the balanced data with 50 percentage malicious and 50 percentage no malicious. And we put the uh, setting with redundant features. The second uh, question we try to answer if there is a noise in our data. So how our machine learning algorithm, they gonna to uh, predict dots uh, uh, malicious node. And the third question, we try to answer it with this setting with imbalanced data, if there is a, a one percentage malicious node and there is 99 percentage malicious, non-malicious, and with the sending five percentage malicious, 95 percentage non-malicious, and 10 percentage malicious node and 90, uh, per, uh, 90 percentage non-malicious, 20 percentage malicious with 20 percentage non-malicious. So with this setting, we try to evaluate the six model of the machine learning. To do that, uh, our result, we come up, we find that the highest accuracy Uh, the highest accuracy of the uh, with the rendered feature with two features that the decision tree we it give us the highest accuracy with 0.62 and with the three features the model support vector uh, classifier is give us with percentage of 0.66 and with the four features we can see that decision tree is given us with the highest accuracy, 0.61. And with uh, five features, we can see that the ingredient boosting is given us the highest accuracy with 0.67. And their second result, we got it from this uh, simulation. When we put a noise starting from 0.01, which is the lowest uh, uh, percentage in the data, and to 1.0, which is the highest noise in the data, we can see the performance of all of these uh, six machine learning classifier. We see with the lowest uh, noise that uh, random forest which got 0.74 and <clears throat> with 0.5 uh, logistic regression which give us 0.52 then uh, again uh, logistic regression it give us the highest uh, accuracy with 0.48 then finally with the highest noise we can see that the gradient boosting it gave us the uh, result with 0.62. And the third scenario, we try to predict when there is unbalanced data in the uh, in our data set. So if there is like one percentage uh, malicious node in our data, like which model is performed better? So we can see from our result that logistic regression with uh, 0.63 give the highest accuracy. And then with five percentage, we got the three models, uh, which is logistic regression, uh, this is three 
support vector uh, classifier and MLP. This three algorithm give us the highest accuracy. And for the third uh, scenario, which is 10% uh, malicious node, their uh, logistic regression and support vector machine and MLP as well, they give the highest result with 0.63. So uh, in the third scenario with 20% malicious and 80% not malicious, we can see that uh, support vector machine and ML, MLP, they give the highest accuracy with 0.7. So from all of these uh, results, we can see that those models, they give us a different uh, a result. Uh, which we, we, cannot, we want to evaluate which model is uh, perform or behave better than other to trust them. And in summary of, of all these results, we got that the, with the maximum identity features, which is five, we can see that gradient posting classifier get the highest accuracy and beat all of the machine learning uh, algorithm classifier. And with the maximum noise with 1.0, uh, again, gradient posting classifier get the highest accuracy. And with unbalanced data, we can see logistic regression get the highest uh, result accuracy. And so we can trust it depend on the result. With our conclusion here, we presented the malicious node a classifier using different machine learning algorithm. And we generate a different data set with different uh, scenarios. We show that the ability of machine learning algorithm to how to predict or how to get the accuracy depend on different uh, scenarios with redundant features, with the noise, and with M plus data set. And we evaluate the three algorithm uh, with area under precision recall. Uh, uh, score of all algorithm, and we apply the matrix with uh, four fifth floors uh, to evaluate the matrix of the model. So thank you very much. Um,